Hi, my name is Robert Steltman. Today I'm going to show you how we can take survey data uh, shooting culverts and bringing them into both profiles and cross-sections. First we're going to use uh, the survey tools break line designer to uh, draw the lines between the survey codes. Here we're showing our surveyor code 56 which is culvert dot three is the third one it could uh, and 760 is a 760 millimeter culvert next we're showing our join dot text file and it shows that anything that starts with a 56 dot something will be drawn with a line on layer CSP next we select create break lines from descriptors we use that text file and we're going to create a 3D polyline this creates the line work for all the culverts in the project. Now we select the culverts from the survey to plan tools. This will rotate the uh, endpoints, uh, the blocks at the endpoints of the culverts, plus label the culvert with whatever we suggested. Now using the row tools profile tools we're going to edit our util utility object data select the 3D polyline and it's showing that we have a culvert of a 760 millimeters and this is the label we're going to be using. Now we're going to select road tools profile tools utilities to profile to transfer the data from the plan to the profile. This produces um, a uh, labels the profile with the station the culvert crosses, the uh, center line elevation, the descriptor we put in, plus it draws an ellipse uh, showing the diameter as 0.76 meters. Next we want to use the cross section tools and draw these culverts from plan onto our cross sections. It will plot it on the cr closest cross section that is in our current drawing. We'll zoom into that cross section and it's showing us the inverts at both ends, the label that we've designed, uh, the label we've decided on, and also it draws in the two lines showing the culvert labeled on the cross section. Another example of how Steltman tools will help you use the LDD to its maximum and uh, speed up your drafting.